Dalton Kincaid in his rookie campaign last year, 91 targets, 73 receptions, 673 yards, and two touchdowns. Thoughts on Dalton Kincaid? You know, there's definitely targets that open up there in Buffalo, right? With with Diggs and Gabe Davis leaving, um, you know, you kind of have this unknown wide receiver room. Dawson Knox is coming back healthy. Um, for Kincaid, you expect him to play a full uh, a full slate of games. Got 16 in last year. You know, so he he basically did that. So I, I could see his targets tick up to, you know, maybe 120, 125, something like that. So um, I, I think ultimately you're going to see some pretty good week in and week out usage from Dalton Kincaid. Um, touchdowns only being two last year. You'd like to see that tick up a little bit and get close to that five mark. But Josh Allen's got to have someone to throw the ball to. And he's got to have someone who can win consistently. Uh, Dalton Kincaid showed that he can he can create some havoc. He creates some mismatches uh, along the outside there. You know, if you want one of the big five, you know, Kincaid is where you get the most bang for your buck. And so I understand that. Um, but again, if you feel like waiting a little bit on quarterback, uh, just over a round, almost a round and a half later is Evan Ingram. Two and a half, three rounds later is is Jake Ferguson. Like, again, I... I I continue to fall back into those ranges because I feel like between those two guys, their stat line will be comparable to Dalton Kincaid's and you get them at such a great discount. It it puts them above him in many regards because of that reason. Yeah. And as a rookie, he flashed at a tight end position, which we typically don't see. It's simply a position where it usually takes a little bit of time to develop. And uh, he certainly became a kind of a fantasy darling that, you know, once he got, you kind of locked into the rosters right around week seven to the end of the season. But yeah, there's a lot of guys that I would rather in that similar draft position, I'd rather go with over, you know, Dalton Kincaid, right? Like uh, Anthony Richardson going just before him in, in that uh, CJ Stroud doing just after, like there's a chance I might actually go at a, at a quarterback in that range there. Um, but if not, I, I'm certainly looking at other wide receivers, Keenan Allen, uh, George, uh, George Pickens uh, going in there from looking running backs. I wouldn't mind going with Joe Mixon or Kenneth Walker in that range as well. Like there's a lot of other guys from a team construction standpoint that I would rather go with um, to, you know, spending my, spending my draft capital there. 